craft and time flies when you're having fun and you are going to have so much fun with this album. It is Album Clock and I think it's not just going to be for albums. I think you're going to have you're going to as you see with one of these other um, projects that I created, you're going to have some neat um, times you <laughs> times using this in um, some home decor pieces or just some neat art pieces to um, to use um, to keep or give to friends or exchange. Um, so I want to show you um, it basically is just that it's kind of an old vintage clock and um, I used it um, to kind of this this one um, I haven't finished it yet but when you open it up I've made these pockets and this is actually a calendar and so um, to be able to put kind of some neat things in it throughout the year this is September and October so either whether photos or some journaling and just to be able to put some fun things throughout the year and you can just add to it um, so you um, some kind of neat paper from uh, Graphics 45 and you can just add through it throughout the year and um, let me I want to show you the die so you can it's just a what it's just one die but you get so much on it just kind of a neat um, and you, there's some things on the die that you can't really see here on the um, on the project so here's what the die looks like so obviously you get this nice big clock with this open face you can do all kinds of neat things on it um, and then here is the, uh, the face that can go on it and so you can't really see it on my project but look at all the little um, the little ticks on here that are those are actually crease blades so those kind of dig into the paper and they're really great if you're cutting chipboard because those really get in there and you can see it really well so if you're doing any of those mixed media um, pieces like with the inks and the paints you can really get in there and you'll be able to see those and then you get like that little center piece that goes in the center and then obviously some um, clock hands so just really simple but you can add to there's so many beautiful um, uh, extra pieces and things that you can buy out there to add to this I'm going to show you another project I did um, so with this project this is where I got into that kind of mixed media and crackling medium and so um, and I'm going to show you another die that kind of goes along with this but um, it's a die you can purchase which is our Roman numerals so and again you know the the watch parts that you can add to this in the center and um, I didn't use the clock hands for this I used like old keys and I, I crackled it and Mod podged it and just added some of um, Cheryl Mazzetti's wings to the edge and just really beat it up and you could hang it or you could put it on a you know a stand or just do a lot of neat things or maybe this is the cover to an album or something but um, anyway I want to show you what our Roman numerals look like too because these are really neat and I think um, obviously they go perfect on this clock but you could use them also um, in your other projects and your other crafting so here's what the Roman numerals look like and um, they start with obviously 12 because we were thinking about the clock when we made these but they go from 12 you know one two three four just in case like if you're like me I get sometimes I'm a little Roman numeral challenged so I get a little confused um, with my Roman numerals but this is a real easy way to remember you start with 12 and you go you know to 11 um, but anyway uh, you're gonna love this die I think it's gonna be really fun to use throughout albums or just a clever way obviously to use with our new um, album clock so those are two new dies um, just really fun and great to use with chipboard and all those different mediums that are out there that um, are so much fun to use right now and um, just a per just a you know a perfect way um, to really get out there and experiment and use different dyes a different way